hey guys welcome back to my channel so i know it's been a while since we last saw each other and for that i am so 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 sorry um but just like this video is titled i was out finding inspiration and you know since my last upload all my ideas and the year the, the desire to create right after it just went away and i was left confused and frustrated you know when i realized that inspiration wasn't with me and um but i did learn a thing or two about it you know in this, in this last month um inspiration truly is a magical thing and what I've learned is that, it, you know, it can be found through a picture, an experience, a song, a movie, a person even. And what it awakens within you is truly something magical. Because what, it, you know, what it sparks within us to, to bring out and may come to life what's within us you know what we end up creating whether it's a project uh a goal that we're after whatever the case may be what it awakens within us is truly something magical because what we end up creating is just something that's a part of us and what we bring what we bring forth out into the to the world for people to see and you know in the process it that the that we go through and the journey that we embark on and, and creating it is it's awesome you know it, uh, inspiration truly is a roller coaster i have to say um but it's so so worth it when you see the outcome of it and, and what you what you put together when you bring forth like i said um but but people myself included you know go after inspiration like it's this quest we have to win at like we have to have it with us all the time and if we don't have it we lose and it's inspiration is not something that you can force to be with you you can't strap it down you can't expect it to be with you 24 7 and you know the the true beauty behind finding inspiration is understanding that it roams freely and when it finds you that's that's when you let it take you you know you don't like i said you don't force it you can't it's almost unnatural to do that to it because it's not meant to be tamed you know what i mean um and hold on because i wrote notes i i have to get this right i have to get it out right um inspiration senses you need them so that's how it goes in search of you there it sends you that sign you need it makes its present it makes its presence known to you in various ways and in the last two weeks of may i felt inspiration with me you know when i realized that it just wasn't with me and i wasn't getting where i wanted to be um, you know i i almost like like I became at peace with it, you know what I mean? Like it was almost like, okay, you're not here, but I putting a deadline on you and pleading with you really isn't getting me anywhere. It's only frustrating me even more. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna let you be wherever you are, whatever you're doing, whoever you're with. I'm just gonna let you be, and I'm gonna continue doing my own thing. And that's what I did. I picked up my camera and I filmed back to back for two days just letting whatever was going to come out come out you know i just kind of almost went with the flow of it and but i didn't stop i didn't give up you know i let myself go through the motion of where i was kind of like in this creative rut where nothing was coming out but i got over it and i let things be and i just like i said i went with the flow of it and um even though nothing came out from it i you know I, I just didn't want to have that pressure on, on myself, you know, and in having to create, you know, and having inspiration be there when it just wasn't. 
you know and it was almost like I just I, like I said I let it be and I can't stress that enough to you guys when you're in search of inspiration just let it be don't force it you know it's, it's only going to frustrate you and it's only going to make you question your ability to create and your ability to even go after a dream or or you know it's going to bring out all these negative emotions that you just don't need um and so like i said you know i felt it with me in the last two weeks because i ended up picking up my notebook and i was writing um i ended up listening to it's almost like it shifted it shifted things around for me to see things that I that I needed to see, songs I needed to hear, ideas I needed to write down, and it's like it it got everything moving for me. It almost it cleared all the clutter away and it made space for itself to just sit with me and you know take me on a different path. You know, take me not a different path, but it just take me down the path that I needed to go on to because it, it knew I needed it. But I knew I wasn't forcing it. It was just kind of like, you know, it, it was almost like I opened the door for it to come in freely. And in that, it just, you know, it, it, it made its way in and it, it let me to create. And in those moments that I found myself creating and writing, like I said, and listening to music and, and just going with the flow of things, it, I felt so much better like I it's almost like I felt the security that everything was gonna be okay you know it's like it wasn't the end of the world because it's been a month since I last uploaded a video I didn't have to worry you know what I mean it's like it was getting it was becoming fun again because that's the whole point of inspiration and and, and creativity it's supposed to be fun it's not supposed to be daunting it's not supposed to be draining it's not supposed to stress you out it's not supposed to be negative and it's definitely not going to be in a negative negative environment i can tell you that um but yeah it's yeah and it also it also taught me a thing or two about my intuition and trusting my intuition um you know, I got this idea to do, you know, there's like um, tags uh, that people do here on YouTube, um, like a get to know me tag. Um, another big one is a plan with me tag where people plan their months and they show you how they plan their months with their calendar and their planner. And that's the idea that I got. And I thought, why not? Why not do something like that? It's so cool. You know, I, I have a planner. I can put it to good use. You know, I can add more things to it. I can get inspired. I can show other people. And as I was doing it and planning it, something just felt off. It, it, it really did. And I didn't understand why. And, you know, my first instinct was to think that oh, I'm not doing it right. You know, maybe I don't have all the equipment. You know, I, I don't have the things that I need to really make this work. And, um, you know, I just, I was just doubting myself. And then I'm like, you know, is this really meant for me? And then I was, I was just battling with it so, so much. And then I, I almost like, I let go. I let the idea go. You know, I let, it's almost like I was just, I surrendered all my worries to the universe in a way. Um, and, and I was just like, you know what? Just show me what I could do because something is just off and I need clarity on this. And what inspiration ended up showing me was that that video, that plan with me video, that as much as I wanted to do it and as much as I love watching other people do it and show that on their channels and as much as I get inspired by it, wasn't for me. It wasn't for me. And that's where all those negative feelings were coming from that's where all these blocks were coming in that's that's what that all that meant and i was feeling it and i was just i just knew it was off but i i it made me see it see it clearly that it just wasn't for me and it wasn't it did not resonate with who i am it does not resonate with what i want to show forth in this channel and yeah you know i it's it's, like I said, inspiration is truly a magical thing. And it definitely taught me 
a thing or two about it and about myself. So, just kidding, that's not playing, you guys. I'm so sorry if you hear whistling. <laughs> Even that's throwing me off. But, yeah, that's that's where I was, guys. I was finding inspiration and it found me. And um, I understand a little bit, a bit more. And, you know, it's okay to feel frustrated and confused when you're in a creative rut but know that inspiration knows uh you need them just don't force them to be with you because it just won't work um have fun you know and it's supposed to be simple it's supposed to be easy it's supposed to feel right when you're creating something you know what i mean and that's that was the biggest lesson I had to learn in this last month that in creating the videos that I want to create and expanding my channel it's supposed to feel easy and I'm not supposed to be stressing out about it at all so you know whatever it is that you may be going through if you're in a creative rut just let inspiration come to you just be patient continue doing your own thing and you'll see you'll see that you'll see the magic is going to happen something is good something magical will happen to you with inspiration if you just let it be and let it roam freely and let it come to you when the timing is right all right you guys so that concludes this video in finding inspiration um i've left all my info down below at the bottom um my twitter my instagram so Stay tuned for the next one. I thank you so, so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video. <laughs> Bye, guys.